this week. And so, as a backup, I say, I don't really feel like a relief. But that's because I didn't really tell, like, anyone close to me yet. And that was a personal choice because I'm still moving towards comfort and letting people know. And I know that may sound weird, to, but it's just because it's... The fact that watching, because I'm finally watching um, my poetry released two years ago, and the fact that I had that fear of telling people close to me that I released a book and I waited. I don't remember how long I waited, but I did wait because, like I just said, I had that fear of nervousness. Um, I had that same fear this time around for my Home Sweet Home debut novel release. I still was like, what if I didn't tell <laughs> the people I know? And I only told just like people that follow me on my author Instagram to see if I could get more organic sales, I guess I'm thinking that way. But like all support is important. <laughs> and so it's just very interesting that I still had that release fear or release feeling. And luckily I did move past it and I did still post to my personal Instagram, my personal Facebook. But it's also like, how do I continue to push past that fear that people I know are going to start seeing my um, YouTube channel, my author Instagram, reading my books, and form an opinion. And whether they tell me or not, that's that's, or whether I'll ever hear about um, how they felt, probably not. But it's naturally going to happen. And if I want to continue moving forward, succeeding in my career, I can't let that stop me. That's only a tiny little portion of so many other things that also stack up that are a part of my fear for my success. And I have to continue to move forward. And so it's just getting past that. Because it's not a bad thing that people I know or knew will know about me pursuing and going after my career and my dreams. Um, but it's just awkward. It feels awkward. Um, but yeah, I don't know. That was just interesting to hear. I see, also watching this video, I just see how slower I am at like responding and filming so I do think I've kind of gotten faster with my videos even though I still feel like my videos are slow and that is not as clean I guess you could say as other author tubers out there or writers out there but I'm me and so I'm posting as best as I can and how um, best I can and so I feel like I am improving since two years ago and so that's good and I am gonna watch my release day video for home sweet home now after this because I'm just curious how like I can see the difference oh also a fun fact of noticing I woke up at 5 a.m or 6 a.m for this poetry release I was up until 3 a.m. from Home Sweet Home. And so, but for the poetry release, it was just because I was literally so excited that I kept myself, like, up or I got myself to wake up early. And then I f uh, filmed some reels or shorts that didn't do really too well, but I had fun making them. And then, but this time for Home Sweet Home, I was more up so late because I was having an up, well, uh, video exporting problem that did get solved luckily but it was still an issue so it's just interesting that i was still up early on each release day we'll definitely see what my next release brings whenever and whatever that may be